What's up guys and welcome to another episode of Spike Reviews. Uh, these upcoming reviews, about two, three, or four of them in the future, are all going to be the products that I got from Mitsuwa. Check the vlog if you haven't seen it, I'm going to link it below. Because uh, I went to QuakeCon and I didn't, really have a t I didn't really have time to review all the products I got at Mitsuwa. So I'm knocking them out now and uh, had to check the expiration date because it's been like a month. Everything is still good. So anyways, without further ado, today I'm going to be reviewing Chipstar. Now from what I've seen, Chipstar is kind of like the Pringles of Japan because they are served in the little cylinder-like container like Pringles are. And they pretty much look like Pringles from what I see in the package. Except their portions are a bit smaller. I know we have the small Pringles, but they're like the travel size Pringles. But I think this is as big as Chipstar gets. So the reason I got these is because I saw them in a claw machine type thing in a Japanese video. And this was the prize. So if you wanted the claw machine, you'd get Chipstar chips. So I saw them and of course I grabbed them because curiosity got the best of me. And I thought these were regular flavor, but upon further inspection I think these are lobster flavor there is a lobster right there I don't know if you guys can see it zoom focus there's a lobster right there so lobster flavored Japanese Pringles I guess let's dig right into this oh another thing I noticed is there is an indention on the bottom and the instructions say to press down on that and squeeze the container in order to pop the top off so you can't just pop it off like this there is actually a special way to pop the top off i guess every snack in japan has a little gimmick and i think it's awesome so ramune has the marble chipstar has the pop thing so let's give it a shot press the star and press this and there we go. That's weird that you have to do that, but whatever. It doesn't smell like much yet. Oh, they're also wrapped inside the container. Pringles are not. As soon as you open it, you see the Pringles. But I guess this is a lot safer and uh, keeps them fresher longer. So let's see. I wonder if it's going to be real fishy smelling yeah that's definitely really really fishy I don't know about these let's dig in just like a Pringle except it smells fishy as hell let's dig in I'll get a full one Not bad, not bad. One more. Not bad at all. The lobster flavor isn't extreme. It smells very fishy, very uh, lobstery, but it doesn't punch you in the face when you eat them. The lobster flavor is very subtle, which is awesome. I like lobster, I like seafood. Chip is really crunchy, it resembles a Pringle 100%, except for the uh, lobster taste of course so I'm gonna have to give these a high 8 out of 10 Excellent. Uh, I enjoy seafood the packaging is really awesome very unique way to open it still kind of weird but very unique and I like that uh, overall taste texture packaging 8 out of 10 so if you see chip star in your local Asian supermarket pick it up they have other flavors as well and I may review them in the future so Thanks for tuning in to another episode of Spike Reviews. Follow me on social media. Instagram, Facebook will be linked below. And check out a video here. Thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace.